we are back for our new Belgium route. I, I'm not very hopeful. If you saw my last video, there was a huge regression in Asheville. It was not good. It was just mistake after mistake after mistake after mistake. Um, so we're going to see how well it does here going to New Belgium. Like I said in past videos, this has been a zero disengagement drive twice. Poor new drivers, man. The person didn't give me any room to make it through that intersection there. It's just the stereotype holds true. Especially here, you have a lot of Floridians that come up called the, the snowbirds. They um, go back to Florida during the winter and they come back up during the summer. I'm honestly not sure how this route has gotten zero disengagements before, but it has. Twice. So it wasn't a one-off. On two different versions. I think it was 10.2 and 10.0. Um, for sure 10.2. It might have been 10.1. I'm not sure exactly which versions. Odd truck. Okay. Okay, I'm to press it through this light here. Still trying to brake too much. Why? All of a sudden it just kind of launches. That's a new behavior with this version. These don't go, don't go, don't go. After this car, you know. After this car, we are good to go. If a person can make it, my car can make it. Like, when that car is on my side of the road, it should slow down. Like, it shouldn't keep on accelerating towards the car that's on my side of the road. Like, these things, like, it, it, we need dojo, everyone. Like, maybe it's just because we've dealt with the same issues over and over again, and Elon's like, oh, we're gonna have rapid progress. And it's just like, I mean, sure, it's quick. I mean, it's amazing what has happened in the last year, but you need to give a baseline of what rapid progress is. I mean, when you have an update every two weeks, you expect things to be better. Like, not get worse with every update. Like, this was a definitely 10.2. I'm pretty sure we had a zero disengagement drive on this. Um, okay, no cars coming. We're good. Let's see if it gets in the correct lane. Is it going to do it? It's... No, it's... No, failed to do that. I thought about it. I thought about doing it right. I've disengaged her every single time and it fails to do it every single time. Now turn right onto Cox Avenue. I'm I'm having a hard time being positive here, everyone. I really do. There's I can't be positive about this. It is literally worse on everything. Like I want this, there's supposed to that was gonna run into that car. Um in five hundred feet, I, it's so bad. And this isn't something a calibration is going to fix. Like, so please don't put that down in the comments. It, it just, it has to be like, like even worse than this for a calibration to help. Like right here, it just gave up. Is it because there's people? It straight up just gave up. I had to press the accelerator to get it to come go through that intersection there. Okay, so we're gonna pause right here and reroute us. I'm thankful for waypoints, everyone. So thankful. That's gonna make this drive definitely easier. I hope, I think. I haven't tried it yet, so we'll see. Um, because we have to cancel the waypoint. Yep. Um, 
braked really hard right there for that guy. Um, that, that stuff just, it just needs to like, it just jams on the brakes. It doesn't just like slow down rapidly. It just straight up jams on the brakes. Now turn right to stay on Church Street. Let's see if it can make it this time. The last time it failed because it got too close to this pillar. So I made it this time. Now turn right onto Buxton Avenue. Yeah. that. <laughs> Okay, so it made that turn good. It's been making that turn good for the last several versions. It, it, it just straight up just gave up. I'm not doing anything right now. Look, look at it creeping through the... <laughs> look at it creeping through the stop. Just the middle of the road. It's like it's searching for something. I think it saw the people. I think that's what's happening. It sees people. And it's just like, well, we're just gonna creep through this, even though the people are like 50 feet away. Like that's the uh, that's based on the release notes. I thought this would be better, not worse. It's literally gotten worse because now it's it's, it's even more cautious of people. Like uh, ridiculously cautious. It's like, okay, a person, oh, you're 100 feet away. Like, yeah, we're just gonna miss our turn. What the? What the hell? Oh, it's not on the next navigation point. Oh. No turn left. We have Westland Avenue. Okay. That's just poor design on waypoints. That's what causes that problem. Um. I have to do it the old-fashioned way. Not sure why we're turning right here. Need to go straight. I'm not sure why this person's going so slow. Gonna hit that curb there. Um, hey everyone, it's just, they, it keeps on getting worse. Every time I come up here, it gets worse. And it's just really like, it's supposed to get better with every update, not worse. The only thing better about this update is less phantom breaking. That's it. Everything else has gotten worse. Let's see how it does with this roundabout here. We're gonna still stop and we're gonna press it through. It shouldn't be stopping in the roundabout. It has a yield sign, not a stop sign. So this was good. Yeah, that worked out pretty well. That was good. That's how it should do. Every single one of them should do that way. Okay. I freaked out because there's people right there. Okay, again, it's stopping for roundabouts and it should just go straight through. I'm having to press the accelerator again. Not pressing it now. Failed it again. It fails to see the medium right there. Which means it's gonna fail to see this one right here as well. Your destination will be on the right. Okay, we're gonna see so much so we're gonna make a full screen so we can no full screen. Full screen. Yeah, it's trying to go into the curb again. See, look, it's trying to change lanes into the people right in there. This 
This is gonna be a record disengagement. Yeah, record disengagement on this one, everyone. Worst this has ever been. People probably think I'm drunk. So we're turning right here. And you can see this curb no problem, but the other curb you just couldn't see at all. See if it hasn't regressed this turn. The last few updates have made this turn good. Yeah, at least I got that right. Yeah. <laughs> got a person on our side of the road this time. So it's doing well on these speed bumps. Got to give it that. Stops from this motorcycle every single time he thinks there's a person on it, even though clearly there's not a person on it. Yep, disengagement for that one. It, like, I don't know why it has to jerk the wheel back and forth, so like, make it smooth. Like, kind of like, float the wheel back and forth. Like, it's like, mm, 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 mm. it's like super robotic. Um, like, obviously it's a robot, but I'm like, it's supposed to act like a human, not a robot. Like, it just jerks the wheel back and forth. I'm like, oh, where do I go? Here, 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 here. I'm not sure. And it's like, it just keeps on doing it until eventually I just disengage because it's just like, it, their movements are far too erratic to go anywhere. Very good cutting, cutting in between those cars right there. Stay on the right side of the road this time. It's doing good so far. Uh, besides the extra slowdown, it did better on this turn. Now turn right onto Haywood Road. Okay, we are good to go. Okay. Yeah, that was a disengagement. It's just like too hesitant. Um, just impeding traffic. When I impede traffic like that, I'll always go ahead and disengage. Unfortunately, it is a Monday, and I guess I never realized that, like, like it's busy. It's busier on a weekday. Well, actually, it's right after Christmas. That's right. Everyone's off this week. That's why it's so busy here. Um, hey everyone. Um, not good. Not good at all. Uh, I think this might be the last video I'm gonna record today. It's just not. I, I'm just not happy at all with this, with this one. Um. We're gonna go ahead, and it's not a parking spot. We're gonna have this temporarily stay right here. No parking zone, right? Just to talk about this. So yeah, uh, I'm not sugarcoating any of this. Uh, this was absolutely freaking terrible, and it's just I'm not impressed with 10.8 on this version. It was it was doing pretty good around Hendersonville. Um, it said in Asheville, I don't know if it's just because there's more traffic than normal. Oh, thanks. But uh, it just it just wasn't great. Uh, I just, the no fans are bust about it. I think, I'm pretty sure this had more disengagements than any other version. And we'll confirm that 
um, through my previous videos. Uh, if you have any questions for me, um, feel free to put them down below. I apologize, for this couldn't have been a more positive video. But if you stuck out um, with me this far, I really appreciate it. And I will see you on the next video. Thanks for watching, everyone. Bye.